I was the first visible character with a disability. That was Catholic series. So I broke ground with that. And it's, I think it was because, like, I never saw myself as disabled. So I didn't realize how big it was. I didn't realize that until years later, how big it really was. Um, my role models didn't per se have disabilities. I mean, the only um, disabilities that I had seen on television were telethons. <laughs> and even if they did shows about somebody with a disability, it was always so dramatic. It was never comical. And I think that's why Facts of Life had problems with me because I think in part they expected Emmy nomination for the episodes that they wrote about me. But I think the reason they didn't get it was because television didn't know how to interpret comedy. How do we, it's comedy, it's not dramatic. They didn't know what to do with me. And I think that was a part of it, because every single episode that I did, they would take ads out in Variety and Hollywood Reporter for your consideration, Jerry Jewell, and Fact of Life, again and again and again. And I never got nominated. So I think it was a disappointment. I think they said, wow, what is it going to take? And I think the only thing that may have changed that is if they did one real, real dramatic episode about Cousin Jerry. In retrospect, I think it would have happened. But they were banking on the comedy, like Norman Lynn said, you're way before your time. Hollywood wasn't ready for something like me. <laughs>